him take? Ooh! Is that a giant arrow? Who you know who does it better than this? I'm the boy who done did it. I'm on top of the list. Trying to get a good signal like a satellite dish. Every day to me. It's like a solar eclipse. Uh -oh. What's up, y'all? It's your boy, South African Geek. Welcome to my channel. We're about to dive right into Hawkeye episode 3. It's called Echoes. We got introduced to Echo at the end of the episode where Kate and Clint got captured by the trap. The tracksuit mafia. Which was comedy gold. Oh my god, that shit. And the whole scene had me cracking up. If you want to see that, it's up on my channel. Episode 1 and 2. Um, I'm really excited. I'm really enjoying this show. Kate Bishop is amazing. Clint is a very awesome human being. That uh, whole fair situation showed his humanity. And I really loved it. Um, let's not waste any more time. And just dive right into it. The third episode like and subscribe if you're not already if you are thank you appreciate it technically we're halfway through who's she working for dun, 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 dun. mother valley studios who's this is it echo is it because she's deaf she can read lips. Damn, when the teacher looks away, it's so fucked up. Telling her to pay attention. She doing the work. Her name is Maya. Her <laughs> oh, sound does a sky make. Does she have an obsession with like dragons? Dad couldn't afford taking her to a deaf school. That's so much responsibility on the kid. Damn. Who's uncle? Maya, you're up. She has a prosthetic leg. Ooh. She studied you, fam. Do they always underestimate her because of her leg? Damn, she can predict their moves. Damn, did like Ronin kill her father or something? Damn, ma. Uh. Damn. So was her dad Loki a criminal? I think in the comics it's Fisk that kills her dad, right? Ooh, she got that arm thing, but it's her father's blood. Like in the comics. Uh. Damn, it's the daytime now. <laughs> he was helping you. <laughs> Imagine dragon tickets. That's so sweet. Apologize for pretending that was a They're interesting, wait, Mafia. Just okay, okay. Is it sleeping? Boy. Want the subtitles in this scene. <laughs> you can't say language. He's not Ronin. <laughs> Look at her, she's nine. He's so, dead. Black like Widow. So what you she got a Tampa issue. MCU 101, have daddy issues. <laughs> Is he gonna take them all down one by one? That they ready to shoot him. <laughs> Damn. Okay, Clint. <laughs> Ooh. This is the best fight coordinator they've had thus far. Damn! She kicked your hearing aid out, fam. Yo, then she stomps on it. Ooh! He got his arrows back! <laughs> She's trying to bite the tape? Ooh! Ooh, that's cool. That's nice. That's nice. Oh, ball pit. <laughs> Ooh. Damn, he's dangerous with this weapon. God damn. This is this is amazing. Yo. They letting the Hawkeye shine in this fight. Ooh. 
she's coming through with the smooth moves too. He can't hear you. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> you, you drive, okay? <laughs> Damn. I remember the strap from the trailer. The moving camera. Ooh. The directing in this episode is phenomenal. Just look at this. Damn, they really like shooting. <laughs> Ooh, that's a nice shot. The camera moving in the car is amazing and following her. They can't see it. He can't hear for shit. <laughs> they're such a great team even though they just met each other god damn they did Maya mad bad what does that one do this is so cool I'm enjoying every second of this episode Ooh, it just pulled every Christmas tree to the sky. Echoes the only one left. Damn, she got great aim. This plunger arrow has to do something else than just plunge, right? Like she's ready. Damn, she gonna really go for a bow. Anyway, I was saying, Maya's really ready to take down an Avenger just to. Get revenge for her pops. Damn. Oh shit. Oh, she's still coming. Ooh. What's that arrow he's shooting? Damn. Arrows are so cool. Pim tech? Ooh. Is that a giant arrow? Bro. A USB arrow? <laughs> Plunge arrow. <laughs> <Trust me. laughs> yeah, this was a dope ass action sequence, man. Ooh, that's so cool. That's the pleasure. <laughs> Damn, Hawkeye really planned out each arrow's use after the other. Archers, you gotta love them. <laughs> They have two separate conversations. He just gave you a compliment. They think about the same thing, but at separate times. This is a great episode. They're really marketing the Rogers the musical thing. Where is he gonna get another hearing aid? He can't even hear the phone call. You're not hearing the kid? Home tonight for movies? Is it okay if you can be home? Damn. Damn. Then he got extremely sad out of nowhere. This morning got out of hand. No. Uncle? Who's the uncle? Is it Wis? Is it Fifth? Oh, she might lose her people. Lucky! The pizza dog. Delete. <laughs> Thank you. A doctor can fix a hearing aid? Kate likes to talk a lot, goddamn. Gotta get some more coffee. She's a younger self in her. She still trying to PR him? Oh, it's the costume scene. This was cute in the TV spots. My job for the last Oh wow. H for Hawkeye. He's done some horrible stuff. Like we saw at the beginning of this episode. Eight minutes left? God damn. It's too short. Dog father. The uncle. I put me a butterscotch? What? Still gonna meet the mother? <laughs> but you knew Tony, man. Riches shouldn't surprise you. <laughs> it's alone limited? 
Somebody's home. Uh, dude trying to play hero with Ronin sword with Ronin. Phenomenal episode. Way too short though. And it was like 40 minutes or like 30 something. Way too short. Way too short. I was having such a good time watching this episode. Phenomenal action sequence and a quite a long one. Some humorous moments with a great introduction to Echo and her connection to all this her origin and seemed like a tease for Wilson Fisk technically uncle uncle you know what I'm saying this was phenomenal keep up the good work Marvel you know what you're doing I'm here for it it's made my day deuces <laughs>